Alaska and catch a tan. We have loggers and they do not look like these ESPN athletes. Here in the Tongass National Forest. Which one looks the freshest? Oh, well, this is what we got. So what, is each piece a different kind of fish? Yeah. since it is the end of the season for Alaska. Um, a lot of this stuff is on clearance, which is nice. These pajamas, beer bum, or bear bum, I mean. <laughs> nice little skate patch. Yeah, it's so funny. Like these right here are on clearance for $24.99, these Alaska um, sweaters. And then they got these on sale as well for $24.99. Is a good deal. If I had room in my suitcase. A few moments later. Yeah, well, we're not on the ship. We're over down by Creek Street. Just walking around. There's a lot of dead salmon down there. Look at that. Yeah, we're over at Creek Street right now. I think we're gonna go grab maybe some food somewhere. And I'm not sure. Yeah, we can go to the fish house. But we'll I probably, think we might go over to the fish house. We'll probably walk the boardwalk a little bit, stare at the seals. There's a place called the fish house that they kept talking about on our tour, so we might go check it out quickly. Oh God, even more. Look at that. There's dead fish yeah, everywhere. We'll check that out. Fresh living salmon right there. They're all over the place. There's a seal. I don't think that's a seal. I think it's a sea lion. Which one looks the best? Which one looks the freshest? It's right here. Oh, there's a bunch of them. See them? Look how fat he is. house at Ketchikan, Alaska. It was a bit of a wait in line to get in and put your order, but as soon as you put your order, they allow you to sit. Limited seating though, as you can tell. We were told it's one of the best places to eat here. But yeah, we were told it's one in of the Ketchikan. best places. And here, we So we got um, uh, the AK sampler. But as you can see, lot, lots of uh, seafood variety. So well, this is what we got. So what, is each piece a different kind of fish? Yeah, hold on, I'll tell you. What are you pouring on there? Yes, it's um, cod, salmon, and halibut. Wow. Halibut. That's what somebody else said, that was the best thing they had. All right. So let's try it. Dig in. Hold on, and then they give you tartar sauce. Tartar sauce. All right. Hold on. Extra Wait. crispy, huh? This is either the cod or the halibut. I don't know what the... How you tell the difference? Steaming hot. How is it? Top. I think that's a cod. Okay. But I don't know, because I've never had cod. Well, how, how does the cod taste like? Good? Well, I think that's cod. Okay. Now this. 
Maybe the halibut? That's a halibut, and that's really good. That's really good? What kind of flavor is it? Halibut. I don't know. What does halibut taste like? I don't know, but... After our dinner last night with the halibut, and this halibut, I'm falling in love with halibut. We will be having it at home. No. Uh, I'm gone. All right, then try the last one. Okay. This one's the salmon. And you can see the pink. Let's try it. It's good. But the halibut's where it's at. There you go. Halibut wins. Later that day. So we are in 270, and they have all kinds of stuff in here. They have hot sanitaria, they have salads, and then they have a pastries and espresso area, and then they have where you can get like hot drinks and stuff. Very cool little area in here. And then, um, show you here, they have like sandwiches and stuff. They have like a Cuban, three cheese melt harvest. B&B, the French, and then they have some cookies, they have uh, different sandwiches you can get in here as well. I didn't realize it was this big, but I got the chopped salad, and he got the French, uh, French sandwich with, with coconut cookie. fried tomatoes and cheese melted, coconut cookie, and uh, lemon meringue. Thank you.